Hi Virgo, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a weekly general reading for January 8th through January 14th. Now this is for the sign of Virgo. I have pre-shuffled this deck, so I'm only going to shuffle it for a moment, and this is basically just going to be a little mini reading about whatever comes up. I will be doing a love reading next. This may not resonate with you, as it's not a private reading. Just take what does and leave the rest. Oh, goodness. I said this wasn't a love reading. Just got done saying it, too. I will focus this camera in once I have the cards laid out. But whatever comes up, comes up. <laughs> you know, and if love is at the forefront of your life, you know, that's what's going to come up. And it appears, you know, that... You know, it's definitely a factor, you know, but that two of cups, love is on the mind. Love is love is on the mind. Whether you guys are thinking about walking away from somebody or and getting a divorce, something like that, you know, this is a separation. You could be contemplating uh, some kind of completion of a relationship or new love could be coming in. You know, if you're single, new love could be coming in. This doesn't have to be love either. It could be a partnership. This could be a new partnership in work, in your job, in a career. Maybe it's a, a new business venture between you and another person. You guys decide to start up a business as partners. That could certainly be the case. This is, um, this is a gift. This is a gift of security. You know, you could be receiving uh, a gift of money from somebody. You know, you could be receiving a gift from somewhere, but this is a, a financial abundance, okay? And this is this is wonderful. This is lack of action. You know, somebody is not um, not moving forward. You know, and this is in regards to uh, maybe you're designed to quit something. Quit something. Uh, I don't know. We'll get more into that. You guys definitely could be receiving some money. You could be receiving a pay raise, uh, inheritance, um, some kind of financial abundance this week. So congratulations, looks good so far in that area. You know, you could be receiving something, some uh, uh, a good amount of money or something on a physical level, a gift of something on a physical level, something tangible, okay, something big. So just have to say it could be an inheritance it could be a gift from a family member okay some a family member you could even win some money I mean there's some money coming from somewhere um, could be a severance pay I don't know there's some kind could be from a settle, a divorce settlement I don't know somebody could be trying to pay you off I mean I just have to throw that out there um, it does feel like you know there's an awakening here there's a wake-up call where somebody decides to do something um, out of the blue you know somebody makes a decision and it happens out of the blue I mean you could get this money out of the blue there's something that happens quite quickly okay so quite quickly um, and I feel like it's unknown you know it's unknown you didn't even see it coming um, there's good news on the way though there's definitely good news something good is coming to you this week um Wow. It's amidst something ending. Something ends and you get something out of it, okay? Because the basis is the Ten of Swords. Something ends and you get something out of it, which is pretty interesting. Um, I think it's something uh, you didn't even see it coming. You didn't even see it coming. Now, with this judgment card right here, it has to do it has to do with releasing something. So, yeah, you you're getting a gift because you let something go because something ended, okay? Whether it's new love, it could be a new partner, okay? You might have you might get, end up getting divorced and finding somebody new. You know, maybe you got divorced months ago, years ago, whatever, and now that's when this new person comes in. Or your you your divorce settlement finally comes into play, or or your disability or something. It just feels like the that something that ended is now paying off very big, very very big for you. Um, it's a big payoff. This is a week of, of payoff. Um, there could be a change in residence. You could be you could be scheduling some travel, or you may be thinking about traveling. Um, maybe somebody's moving in or moving out of your house. Um, 
what else do I have here? Your new love could certainly be coming in. I know this is not a love reading, but I have to really throw that out there. A new love could be coming into your life, and it could happen uh, very spontaneously. I'm going to get some more cards here. Let's do some clarifying. This is a general reading. This is a general reading. Let's clarify this um, Ten of Swords. What's this Ten of Swords in the middle? What's this completion? This loss. There's some kind of loss that all this abundance stems from. There's a loss. The loss happens and you you get a reward because of it, which is, you know, weird, but that happens a lot. Ah, uh, Somebody was dishonest. Somebody was dishonest. Somebody was hiding the truth. The truth comes out and you get a payoff out of it. Somebody's dishonesty comes to light. Okay? This is what it is. It is. Some secret that came out is a secret came out. Okay? Or a secret is about to come out and it's going to work in your favor. Okay, you're you're the benefactor of this. You are going to benefit from this this loss, this lie, this dishonesty. You know, you're going to be the one that benefits and it wasn't you that did it. Somebody else did it. Somebody else's dishonesty is is uh somebody's dishonesty, somebody's lies are benefiting you okay and, and you're gonna the thing is and, 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 and if it was you you are being called to step back and be still and to think and to contemplate and to restructure okay because it, it looks like structure is needed things have been a little chaotic okay and that's why and, and so you know this I said it was the other person but you know, now that this is here, it tells me that perhaps you may have had a, had a hand in this. You know, because, but you didn't do it on purpose. I don't think that you've done anything on purpose by, by not uh, planning, by moving too fast. You know what I mean? But then again, you're the benefit. You're the benefactor of this. Because I see abundance. I see security. What's this two of cups up here? I think, uh, well, I'm going to get the card and see what happens. What's this Two of Cups? This Two of Cups is in regards to you receiving the peace and harmony that you so much desire and deserve. It's like you are a giver. You have given. You have given and given and given, and it's time for you to receive. And the, this is the universe saying, okay, it's your turn. It's your turn. We're going to give to you now. Okay? So I, I believe that it's your turn to receive the affection, the love, whatever it is that you desire, that you deserve, okay? And if this is a partnership, if, ship, if this is in regards to work, it's your turn to receive the abundance via the passion that you love do you know what I mean doing what you love okay so if you are if, if you are thinking about starting your own business or you are starting your own business with somebody and it's something that you are very passionate about it is your turn this is the universe saying yes go for it that it's your turn it's your turn to receive you definitely could be receiving a a sum of money this week or in the near future that you deserve and it could come out of the blue and I think it comes um, after a time of disorganization chaos dishonesty arguing you know there's been some strife and I think that now the strife is over and you're getting what you deserve. And that's what I have. Actually, I was going to give you a, one more card. I almost forgot it. I'm going to give you an advice card. This is for general. We're going to do love next. 
release and surrender. We shower you with blessings of our radiant love. Open your arms and release the challenges that you've held tightly gripped within your hands. Open your hands, arms, and heart to our love and assistance. Release and surrender. Whatever this is that you're letting go of is bringing you prosperity, security, and abundance. And a new partnership, whether it's in work or love. A new partnership is on the horizon. And that's it. 